astronomy compels the soul to look upward and leads us from this world to another our heartfelt greetings to everyone today i tanishka dhondial and my companion aditya singh mehra are here to present our science project under the annual science exhibition scientific solutions for challenges in life amidst the new normal we are very enthusiastic and grateful for this opportunity provided by the school the name of our project is soda bottle magnetometer which comes under the sub theme alternative sources of energy the contents of this presentation are as follows about the makers introduction uses working and thank you page The magnetosphere is the region of space surrounding Earth where the dominant magnetic field is the magnetic field of Earth rather than the magnetic field of the interplanetary space. The magnetosphere is formed by the interaction of solar wind with the Earth's magnetic field. Thus, we will be constructing a magnetometer to monitor changes in the Earth's magnetic field for signs of magnetic storms. and we will be requiring the following materials to construct this project a 2 liter soda bottle 2 pounds of sand 2 feet of sewing thread a bar magnet an index card a piece of soda straw a mirrored dress sequin super glue a clear packing tape a meter stick and an adjustable high intensity lamp now i would like to call upon aditya singh mehra to explain the project further Thank you, Tanishka. Now, for the uses of a magnetometer, a magnetometer is widely used in a variety of different types of industries, ranging from military purposes to their use in astrological projects. One of the most common use of magnetometer is its use as a navigator or compass, usually built in our mobile phones. In military magnetometers are used to detect metal objects and also for the detection of submarines. The most important use of magnetometer is in astronomical ventures. Without magnetometers almost no astronomical venture is possible. They are used for exploration and automation of the probes and satellites that are sent outside of earth's orbital and towards other celestial bodies. As for our soda bottle magnetometer, it is used to detect geometric storms and also helps us to measure the changes in the magnetic field of our earth. Working of our magnetometer. Now, before I explain you the working of our soda bottle magnetometer, let's talk about how it is made. Firstly, a soda bottle is taken and sliced one third from the top. Then, fill with the sand to maintain its position and avoid any kind of instability. Then, a straw and a bar magnet is taken and glued to each other. With the help of a thread, a triangular loop is made and the device is then fixed to the bottle. A mirror is also fixed to the middle of the other side of the magnet. Adjust the magnet accordingly so that it doesn't touch the bottle. Join the bottle back. The soda bottle magnetometer is ready. Now, for the working of our soda bottle magnetometer, the working of our soda bottle magnetometer is quite simple. The working goes like this. Firstly, a lamp is placed beside the magnetometer. Make sure that the light from the lamp is hitting the mirror of our magnetometer. Mark the point where the light is reflected on a nearby wall. After some time, due to the change in the Earth's magnetic field indicating the presence of a magnetic storm or a geometric storm, the previously reflected point will be slightly displaced from its original position. This phenomenon suggests that a geometric storm is approaching. One thing to keep in mind is to take the readings when no other kind of metal object is near our magnetometer as they will disturb the magnet inside the soda bottle magnetometer thus resulting in a different outcome. Conclusion Our project helps us to monitor the earth's magnetic field and earth's environment 
It also helps us to predict the weather due to the changes in Earth's magnetic field.